Hi, so let me tell you how the Pinebook, a computer that was sold for like 75 years plus shipping, is helping me go through university. So the first question that I want to answer is, why do you need a computer in the first place? Can't you just use paper notes as everybody else is doing? So at the beginning of university I was indeed using paper notes. However, I found them to be extremely inefficient because of my study method that I decided to take. Because I investigated a bit online and I found out that using spaced repetition flashcards was actually a good way of memorizing stuff. And as nice as mathematics is, lots of it is memorizing demonstrations and definitions. Like a good bunch of it. Like, let's be real. You have to memorize a lot of stuff. So what I decided to do is use these flashcards. But in order to have the flashcards, I had to take my paper notes and then get a computer and transcribe everything onto LaTeX in order to be able to actually understand anything on the computer, rephrase it as question and answer. And this took like hours. And when I actually finished transcribing all of my notes, I hadn't the time to actually study any of them because, you know, I just spent hours just transcribing that. So it was actually just a waste of time. This flashcard st study method was not working. So what I decided to do with some tips of my friends was to actually just write the cards during the lessons directly in LaTeX using the pen book. Now, I usually use this computer which is like there and it's a better computer like 750 euros that's 10 times as much however the battery is bad and it would not have lasted like all university length long which is like four hours the pine book was actually going to go through them so i just took it at university and it has a good display a good keyboard and i just started typing latex I had to learn it, but after learning it, it worked. And there's many benefits to this because, well, first of all, you don't have to worry bringing different notebooks. You just bring the bind book and you know you've got everything set up already. Also, I type faster than I actually write, so that's very nice. I'm able to follow the lesson more, uh, more easily. And the paint book is actually super lightweight, so it's actually smaller than my notebook and weight less, and I just have more room into my backpack. I just take it out, open it, do whatever, put it back in the backpack, and I'm good to go. It's almost as if it wasn't there which you cannot say of, you know, that computer right there. Then what did I do? Well, I couldn't actually just write the Anki notes because I decided to use Anki, which is open source, supports space repetition. It's very nice. If you're studying things that needs memorization, uh, you should check it out. It's really good. Like uh, I'll make some screenshots and stuff. I love it. I couldn't just write the cards directly because Anki doesn't uh, show the latex you're writing live so i didn't know if it was correct or not so i decided to use kile which is an application from kd which you should know if you don't go check out kd.org it's the organization that i'm in with kile i'm able to write latex in just a latex application and i just wrote everything in the form of question and answer and then i wrote a little python script because i write little python script for everything that takes the latex file and just converts it into question and answer in the mathjax syntax because that's the one that Anki accepts without complaining. So I just have to copy paste everything onto Anki's website which is synced with my phone and that's it. I just pop up my phone, I see the, answer, the question, I try to remember the answer, I click show me the answer, if it's correct I press correct, if it's not, well, it's not. And that actually pretty much helps. And I like this method so much that I didn't like stop at mathematics. I decided to study chess with it. 
So what I did was to take my end games book, which I do have on my e-reader. Basically, I just took all of the example situations. I took the fan of them which is the code that memorizes the chessboard uh, pieces. And then Anki supports just showing the chessboard given the fan position. And in the answer, I put the best move. And then I wrote a little Python script, again, which just takes an opening and generates automatically uh, the best moves given on the opponent reply. So that helped me study the chess openings, I'm currently studying the Polish one, and that's about it. So it's actually a video to praise the fact that when I realized that my computer wasn't going to work for writing LaTeX live during the mathematical, the math lessons, and that I actually needed to write directly all of my notes into LaTeX during the lessons to be more productive, well, there was a device that was just fit to you know do that and maybe in the future i will buy a new computer and that computer will have more battery but i do think that using the pine book also helped me stay focused because on my main computer i do have all of my you know stuff with personal projects this video making thing for my channel thingy and if i brought that computer i know that i would get distracted but with the pine book there's only literally only latex uh, files and notes so that's all i'm going to be focusing into so it also helped me and i hope that it will continue working and then i will be able to pass all of my exams hopefully yeah <laughs> that takes the latex file and just converts it into question and answer in the in the math jax uh, in the math jax syntax because that's one i like how the fuck do you say comodino <laughs>